<clears throat> Voila! Inside this box is Twinkle Wish, the wishing star. May I see? No! Nada? Negative. This box absolutely must not be opened until tomorrow at sunset, when the Winter Wishes Festival begins. How come? Because Twinkle Wish is asleep. She needs every single moment of her cutie sleep in order to have enough magic to grant everyone in Ponyville their wish. Do you understand? Yes, I do. Alrighty then. By the honor invested in me by the good ponies of Ponyville, I now present you, Shirley, with Twinkle Wish, the wishing star. The fate of the entire festival is in your hands. Okie dokie then. See you later. So long. Sayonara! Ooh, the box is so Look pretty. Oh, dashingly beautiful oh. box. I can't see a thing. Me neither. <gasps> I've got an idea. Come on. I sure would like to see Twinkle Wish again. I know, but we can't. You heard the mayor. Too bad. I can barely remember what she looks like. Me neither. But Shirley's right. The girls knew they shouldn't open the box, but that didn't stop them from really, really wanting to. Especially Scootaloo. I want to get a closer look! <laughs> Scootaloo! Yeah, it's a neat box. But I want to see what Twinklewish looks like. One, he can't hurt. <gasps> is known about it because no one has actually been there the mountain is named for the strange behavior of the weather it changes suddenly and drastically for no apparent reason willy-nilly how do you know all that cheerily i read a lot hello how's our star i'm fine thanks for asking <laughs> i wasn't talking about you star song i was referring to the wishing star i trust the twinkle wish is safe and sound and unharmed in any way she's fine see still in the box free from harm completely in the pink safe as a bug in a rug sleeping like a baby Shh. 
It's heartwarming to see such responsibility, dependability, and accountability. Ta-ta! We lied. I know. We should tell the truth. We will. When? After we get Twinkle Wish back. Look, just because a humongous dragon that we've never seen before snatched her and took her to a mountain nobody has ever been to before doesn't mean she's gone forever. It doesn't? No. Are we going to let that dragon get away with taking Twinkle Wish? No. Are we just going to sit here and mope or are we going to do something about it? We're going to do something about it. But what? We're going to find that dragon and get Twinkle Wish back. Yeah! We can do it. We must do it. We will do it! But the mountain is super far away. How can we make it there and back in time for the festival? <gasps> I know! We can fly there! In my hot air balloon! <laughs> Everyone got ready for the journey and then met up at Pinkie Pie's house. <gasps> Rainbow Dash! What in the world? I did a little itty bitty bit of packing. All right, all right. But I have to bring something. Take this. Fine. Make room for us. I've made all the room I can. I'm afraid this balloon is only big enough for four. You two are going to have to stay here. That's not fair. You did this on purpose because you're mad at me. No, I didn't. But even if I did, who could blame me? I could. I'm sure nobody did anything on purpose to get anyone mad, right? Right. Scootaloo, it's a good thing you're staying here because we really need you to do something very important. Oh, yeah? What? We need you and Sweetie Belle to take special care of Twinkle Wish's box until we come home. Can you do that? Take care of it how? I know. We'll take care of it so no one knows Twinkle Wish is missing. Especially the mayor. Come on, let's get this show on the road. Balloon in the air. Drink candy, a little bit scary. 